New campaign. Normal, sir. Yeah, I do this. The saboteur. Freaking knows. Um, should I do the training? Screw it, why not? Welcome to the combat training facility, Captain. Colonel Clark and his team have developed the advanced armor and weapon systems that you will be testing today. And we're both tapped into your suits, telemetry, and camera feeds, so we can see how you get okay. on and provide remote tactical support. Oh, I gotta turn media down. One second there. Um, now I'll go to Twitch. There we go. Um, yeah, I don't need to charge my controller. I mean my, uh, phone. I will put this somewhere else so I don't bump it all the time. <laughs> Stupid, um, thing. Oh. Yeah, I uh, will not let you get that trophy no matter what. At least on the tutorial, it will not let you. Uh, the freaking trophy to never uh, fire your gun. Yeah, I hope uh, the saboteur like better. And then that. And then the tank. I don't know why. I just did not like the tank. Every character gets something new, okay. Um, public, friends only, not allowed. Yeah, I'll do normal. Um, oh. Nothing but ice and shadows now, Colonel. 
Luckily, the auto map is big enough to patrol transceiver signals. Not far away. Yeah, I try to do that. Um, no freaking. What's that? He dropped. Like, don't fire your gun. You see a purple already? Frickin' ass, get away. Yeah, that's really weird. A purple frickin' already. I said I was going to be 30 minutes, about 30 minutes late because, um, I wanted to, uh, watch that movie. Idiot, I shoot, I messed up so hard there. Oh well, god damn it. But I did get a freaking respawn point, so yeah, it's not that bad. But I don't understand why I accidentally pressed the PlayStation button. And isn't that what it's universally called, the PlayStation button? Well, it does have the PlayStation logo, so what else would you call it? Yeah, even if I get killed there, it's so whatever. Oh, 
Oh shoot. Um all frickin' stupid belt. I don't know why I tied it not up too much. That's not a smart thing to do. Okay. Ow! Damn it. I was one way from one hit away from for death anyways. gives me that trophy because I don't understand why I wouldn't. Um Neil Yeah, I hope uh, I do that. Well, it gives me the trophy for that. Because it's not like I fired my gun at all. So I, under I don't understand why I wouldn't, but I'm still freaking scared that a wolf for some dumb reason uh, god and this freaking god out tutorials Yes, I already know that. Captain, those bodies, are they UNX? Obviously, I'm not it's doing it for a reason. <laughs> oh, come come on, how many are there? Holy. There we go. That was insane. The amount of enemies, but whatever. I made it out. Where's the freaking thing? Oh, there it is. Is that it, seriously? Oh no! Oh well. I didn't get the freaking thing. Oh, uh, the chest. I didn't know I had to get it before he landed. Oh well. Yay! There's a trophy for all firing your gun. Battle they haven't managed to locate their crashed ship. 
I didn't know, um... I just want to make sure it's a uh, freaking thing. Like it didn't uh, reset to default for some reason. The freaking thing. And um, I don't know about that one. I think I can do that one. It's uh, to not uh, use melee or any abilities. It's just obviously a freaking. Uh, run away, freaking vacuum. Oh, that sucked.
Yeah, that's what they do. Uh, camouflage. Um, I do that. Oh, shoot. Um, why is there so many? Get that frickin' tip off the screen. <laughs> it's costly it goes on the screen over and over. It's like, yes, I know how to fire. Or melee, or frickin' grenade. It's like, stop. You only have a show me it once.
Get out of holy cow, why is there so many? It's just insane how many there are. Oh shoot. Holy cow. Do you think that's a little much? Oh, uh, where's the uh, thingy? On my spawner. Get out of here. Oh yeah, I don't know why he freaking stopped talking and got distracted, I guess. That, um... I just was 30 minutes late because of, uh, the obviously the Demon Slayer movie. I started watching it around, like, I don't know, I think it was 9, yeah, 9.30. Yeah, so I freaking finished it at, like, I think 11.30. Which obviously I would have enough time to, uh... Freaking stream because it was only that time. But obviously... I had to eat too. Oh yeah, that took about 30 minutes. God damn it.
But yeah, freaking um, I'll probably do that though. Like watch Steam Star movie again after I stream, of course. Uh, then obviously give it a break after. Like, maybe it's a hype talking, but I could see why freaking Team Slayer got, um, so praised. Oh, god damn, I don't have enough bullets for this. Oh, I do. Never mind. I, when I tried to reload, it didn't though. What the hell? Yeah, I like, um, this better. That saboteur. Because, yeah. He's more of a mix of, uh, close and, uh, close and long range. Well, the, obviously the sun is close range. While well, the s scientist is freaking far range. Or I could be wrong about that, I don't know. God damn it though. Oh. Because his weapon is really good. Ow. He kills more than one person. One enemy at a time, I should say. Yeah, that's kind of weird, the... God damn it. Yeah, I have to go through here. Oh god damn it, I keep pressing R3. I keep loading. Because it's such an easy band to freaking push. Especially when your thumb is right on R3 to aim. Shoot. 
Oh, great. Oh, green gun. Freaking Christ, why will you not freaking die? Did I kill them all when it went up here? No. They destroyed the turret. Good to see you in 
Oh no. Scans of the crashed ship wreckage. I don't know if I actually did that. If I did oops. Accidentally hit or something. At least that's what I'm guessing because I didn't get uh, anything. Okay, this is the best one. Everyone else is garbage. Um, all yes. Yeah, my friend said that. And it's like... Um, why don't I play Shin... Uh, Shin Megami Tensei 3, or get it. And it's like... The freaking game is, um... Yeah, the game is freaking... What is it, like $66 normally? And... $50 on Amazon, so that's cool, it's uh, a little bit of a reduction on Amazon at least. Oh, I don't think I got it because I'm not allowed to when I uh... Like, shoot, I'm not allowed to run either, I'm pretty sure, so... It's like, how the hell would you do that? Oh, you need more people. Got a freaking thing finally. A secondary. Oh, it's one of those guns. Yeah, I get that um off stream. Like, I have used no abilities, I can't freaking run, I can't do anything, so yeah, I'm gonna do it on the first level. I mean, cause that level is short. And there's, um, a lot of, uh, freaking thingies. Like, respawn points.
There we go. Yeah, that's weird I was thinking about that. Yeah, it's just so weird, like, why do, uh, people have such a boner for graphics? It really makes no sense to me. Like, what I mean is, uh, frickin' I was searching, um, frickin' a thread on, e not on YouTube, on Twitter, about, um, PS5. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a thread, like, I don't know what those are called to action, to be perfectly honest. But, uh... Yeah, it's just a freaking bunch of tweets about the PS5. So, thread, whatever, I don't know, I don't care, really. But anyways... It was like, there was this, uh, one tweet, like, um, next-gen check-in, like, June 2021, and he showed a picture of, uh, Ratchet and Clank, obviously, worth the part, and then frickin' Xbox was just blank, and it's like, okay. But then I read the comments, and it's like, one guy said, oh, this looks like PS3 game, blah, 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 and it's like, I know it was just whatever, but, yeah, I just don't really get that. Well, I guess especially after, like, I played, uh, uh, games that are cold, uh, looks like a PS2 game on PS4, <laughs> and it's like, um, why does that matter? I really don't understand. Because if you're having fun, what's, what's the point? Who really cares? But I say that, and that's true to an extent, obviously, because... Like, obviously it's on, it does it, it does it to like, good looking games and not so good looking games. That, um, freaking obviously, um, not every 
game you think is going to be good actually turns out to be good. So like, that's why I just don't understand Fatboy. It's like, who cares? Like, as long as it's fun, why do you care? But I don't know, it's just stupid. And I'm not going to say I don't do it. It's just, I don't know, it's dumb and I know that, but I still do it. Ow. Oh my. Oh my. I don't know if it's true, it just seems like that. The thing. Yeah, Nintendo is just. is just trying to, like, oh, this is stupid, let's not do it. Because I don't know, it seems like Nintendo always does its own thing. And doesn't really worry about um, the console stuff. Like, who has better games? Blah blah blah. It just seems like they don't really care. And. That's what I like about Nintendo, but what I don't like is that their games are just so high priced. It's just absolutely stupid. Uh, honestly, that's why I never really liked Nintendo. Like, I won't really l let myself like Nintendo because that reason. I know it's stupid, but... It's true, if their game's freaking... Like, stay around like $70 for a year after they release this, like... You know what, how about no? I know people say your games are good, but I just don't see it. Your games are like just another game to me. Like they really are. And 
And yeah, I guess so. We'll do that. Uh, try freaking knockout city or whatever it's called. But yeah, I don't think it's as good as uh, people say it is. Like I was watching a uh, uh, achievement hunter thing and they were praising the game but it's like I don't know they said uh, it was like uh, freaking uh, fall guys in that like when you like it you just like it and no, it's just, uh, yeah, I never was one for multiplayer. I really wasn't. That's why I play. I'm not gonna lie and say I never play multiplayer games. Obviously I do, but I more or less play them alone. Oh yeah, I forgot that. Oh well. Um, Dungeon and Dragons Dark Lions. Because, yeah, that's a game that came out. So, yeah, I think I will do that. I'll only play this for a bit. Switch over to World War Z because that's leaving places now soon. Uh, then I'll play freaking uh, what is it? Uh, Dark Alliance. Yeah, I'll play this shorter than I thought I would. About like, wait how long? Oh, it's been an hour now. So yeah, I'm probably gonna play it another hour. Then switch to Born War Z, probably play it like an hour and a half. Or however long it takes me to complete a chapter. Because there's five chapters. And I wanna obviously do all the chapters uh, before the end of the month. Which is in eight days, so it's like, yeah, I think I could do it. God damn it, why are there so many so freaking 
keep spawning, spawning, spawning. Stop doing that. Just kept spawning and spawning. Like, that's a little bit wide on, like, uh, the PS4. Like, it's cool that it ha uh, can do stuff the PS3 can, like, uh, just have a load of enemies on screen, but... That's also what I just don't really like because if there's just a huge amount of enemies on screen and they like never uh, stop spawning it's like okay this is don't you think you're going a bit overboard sort of thing <laughs> That is true, like, how can you get upset about that and, uh, yeah, you can't, obviously, <laughs> about, um, Microsoft putting cloud gaming on Xbox so you get to play series games. But you gotta also understand it's like they're doing that for kind of one reason. And if you think it's all out of the graces of uh, the kindness of their heart, you're freaking wrong. I don't know what to say. It's wrong. Obviously, they're doing it for the money because. Let's say you don't want to upgrade, you could still play those sad games. Sure, they will be cloud, uh, on the cloud, but you can still get to play them. So, like a cheap asshole like me, I'm... Yeah, I was planning to do that anyway, so just freaking uh, play uh, their games on the cloud through my phone, but now I could do it through the Xbox One and have the same freaking experience. Maybe not the exact same, but more or less.
Oh, come on. I didn't know there were freaking behind me. They're everywhere. See, that's what I mean. Like, it goes a little freaking overboard. Well, a lot overboard, I should say. With the enemy. <laughs> But even though it does uh, this, I'm still, uh, obviously, I still like it, it's just, yeah, it's weird, this game brings frustration but fun at the same time, <laughs> it's like, what? That was an egg, it wasn't. Killed everything here, <laughs> Jesus. So. Um. Oh, do I ever go? Where do I ever go? Oh, back over that I think. Uh, here. If I could freaking go, there we go. God damn it, are you serious? <laughs> I shot one bullet. Oh, I've ever loaded. God damn it.
Is that the end? Uh, how do I get over there? Oh, I have a go through goddamn deep pad. You have to go around. Okay. Yeah, that's another genre that I really like, is twin, uh, twin sticks. It's twin sticks. Freaking Christ. Yeah, that's why, like, n I don't know why I didn't see it before, but yeah, that seems to be the case. Uh, that indie developers obviously, since their budget is lower, like, I think they uh, use, they try to use tricks to make you get their game and the tricks they use are freaking making uh, the game like really unique to try and get your attention. But I think that's why. Like, I don't like most, uh, freaking in games. Because they do that. Like, because, honestly, I play Crimson Land. A very simple twin stick shooter. Like, very simple. Basic. And that was. Obviously, it got repetitive because it was, yeah, the same thing over and over again. But, um, yeah, it was better than most of the games I played <laughs> that I ever played, I should say. So I think it's that. That any of the developers of course want to be unique because they want to like make it a change your pace other than what you get from AAA games. The experience you get from those games, they want to be different. But just because um, you're different than a AAA game and trying to be unique doesn't mean your game is actually good. Again, I don't know why it took me so long to figure that out. But, yeah. Now I know, more or less, basically why I don't like indie games. For that exact reason. Yes. 
that um they just want to be too unique and I just don't care for it. Obviously, two other people would say differently, but oh well. Yeah, it was also that thing I thought was stupid. Revolver. Like, because I'm not gonna say it's not, uh, not true at all, because it is. Like, focusing on, um, like a few different, uh, platforms will obviously make the game better. But, at the same time, it's not like, um... Uh, freaking games that aren't, uh... Like, multi-platform games aren't, uh, like, broken messes either, so... Again, what Todd Howard said with, uh... Focusing on uh, just Xbox to make a better game is it is true, but to an extent because it's like Bethesda's um, it's a big freaking studio. So you're telling me that you um, maybe I'm just reading too much into it, but you're telling me that. You can not make games on multiple platforms. And that's just BS so hard. <laughs> And, uh, even stupider things, people will actually believe it. Well, mostly just because it's Xbox exclusive now, they'll, um, freaking Xbox fanboys will believe anything, as well as obviously any kind of fanboy, PlayStation, uh, PC, all that. But PC doesn't really have like a CEO, of course. They have uh, Bill Gates who made the Macintosh. I'm pretty sure it was Macintosh. A uh, freaking like platform, if you want to call it that. But yeah, there's not one, like, boss, like, Sony, obviously, has Jim Ryan, there's other, uh, big wigs, I guess you could say, like, Shuhei Yoshida, and, I forget who else, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know if I was reading too much into that, though. SMG. 
Uh, because with the PS3, if he said that then, I would be, uh, more or less believe him because obviously the games on PS3, yeah, they were freaking bad. But, um, obviously, uh, with them releasing freaking, uh, Fallout 4, it's like, yeah. But then people would say, like, oh, what about Fallout 76? I think, yeah, with Fallout 76, I think that was... Uh, that game was broken from the start, and they knew that, but they said, oh, who freaking cares, we'll freaking make money anyways. Because her Bethesda. Oops, what am I doing? This isn't the way. Oh, it is, but I need, uh, yeah, it is a way. Oops, never mind. Freaking crazy. Yeah, and it's like, I just, um, like, whatever an Xbox, but whenever I, uh, yeah, whenever I keep seeing stuff about Xbox, it's, it's just getting stupider and stupider, <laughs> it's like, God, people are freaking gullible and cheap. Because, I don't know, I think that's stupid, I don't know if that's true, because I didn't see it myself, so I don't know. But, uh, I guess people believe that, uh, Spider-Man Mars Morales can only be done on PS5. It's like, um, okay, I guess. Yeah, and I don't know why people, uh... Yeah, I don't know why Sony did that. Yeah, because they basically Just lied. Freaking... Oh, I think, uh... They did that because with the PS4 they got backlash. But yeah, why didn't they? Of course it would get more backlash with this strategy.
Uh, what I mean is, um, yeah, with the PS4, I think they, uh, got back last week because there was, like, games that could be played on the PS3. A lot of games. Now with the PS5, they kind of try to hide the fact. I honestly don't know why. Okay, probably one more mission I do. Oh, you could customize. Cool, but I'll get more uh, armor later. I don't know when exactly. Oh, did I? Um. Yeah, I guess I completed this. Okay. download it but it will take about 15 minutes yeah I forgot about that so yeah when I end this I'm going to be about I would say 20 30 minutes I'll just say that again uh, when they stop. I don't understand this. Why I'm getting such good stuff. Yellow. Oh shoot, I don't have yellow.
was here. Uh. King Christ, no, that's out of here. Oh, what the hell? Where did they come from? So many. And they all spawn from behind too, that's annoying. Oh, there's a freaking boss here. Oh, there he is, I think. Are you him? God damn. Oh no. God. Where do they respond? Falling out of. Yes, it's stupid. Yes. Oh, God damn it, you freaking asshole. Get away from me. Oh my god, dude. Oh, these freaking assholes. I don't know why, uh... This map is different. Do they, um, uh, do are they roundly generated? They must be. I don't see another freaking uh, explanation. Yeah, I think they are.
I'm going down. I thought she was stomping at first, but she's freaking hammering. Can you stop? There we go. Took him down. There's another boss. God damn it. Come on, I'm crazy. Oh, oh, freaking purple. Um, Um, hmm. Jesus, I just went down there and there's a bunch of enemies waiting for me. Oh, there is an asshole. There is somewhere. Oh, I'm stuck on something. Oh, there is another asshole. Oh, that's why there's so many of these guys. They keep it spawning because of this. Nice work, Captain. Another nest exterminated. Oh my, funny better primary oh it's not a huge better but it's something
me so Yeah, that sucks. I uh saw that right before um I started streaming. that apparently the new uh, pass to Marvel Avengers shows your IP address on the screen is like cool yeah that's exactly what you want to show your IP address when you're streaming because of stupid uh a patch bug. Oh, I was, uh, did I say that before? I don't remember, to be honest. That, yeah, it does. Uh, it is funny that it does seem that way. That, um, oh, this is Square Enix is, like, stopping the live service model. Like, with Crystal Dynamics, with, uh, Marvel, uh, Avengers. Because with, uh, what is it? Oh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Apparently that's going to be all single player. It's like, cool, I guess they're abandoning that. Because I don't know. Like the whole life service small thing is just freaking stupid. I think it so severely is. Or games as a service, whatever. gun had no full. That's what I really don't like when your gun has no bullets. Why doesn't the game switch guns? It's not that I don't think, uh, 
Uh, Square Enix know how to do live services. It's just sad. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Yeah, it's like you kind of have to come into live service games with an MMO mindset. Like, to just constantly give like new uh, content, blah blah blah. Because obviously, if a game doesn't feel worth your time, you're not going to play it. It's as simple as that. Yeah, it's not like it's a hard thing to figure out. I don't know, like, the bumpers get kind of dumb after a while thinking they're just invincible sort of thing. Like, just because they, uh... made a like a uh, really popular game I will get of I don't know like Fallout for example like sure it's big but eventually it's gonna fall sort of thing Like, when, who knows? Is that it? Yeah. Oh, come on with these guys again. We're going faster. Okay. 
freaking got him. Um, is that it? Ooh. Oh crap. I didn't see those guys. I said I would stop there. It's a little bit less than um two hours, but well played, Captain. barely. It even larger force than expected. What one fifty? Resources. Okay. Uh, guns are just level, not level mob, but I uh, do that. Oh, that's gear. Oops. That's secondary, no primary. Okay. Um, ammo color. Let's go red, I guess. Um, upgrade. Did I get any new armor? No. So yeah, the... Frickin' um... The saboteur, like... is not as good as scientists, but it's still good. Yeah, and I'll uh, obviously be about 20-30 minutes just because of the download. And that sucks, but anyways, whatever. Um, I'm gonna... I'm guessing I'll be an hour or so with that, with uh, World War Z, because I'm gonna beat one chapter at a time. I know I could record it, but I don't think I'll be exactly an hour though. But anyways, 
but some blabbering and I just want to say thanks for all dude watching all that good stuff and goodbye um and I'll press the share button whoa that'll be 20 30 minutes uh I'll just be back with World War Z so I won't really say goodbye but anyways I'll press the share button and eon